hello guys welcome to my channel today we are going to see how to fix microsoft store white blank screen when trying to log into microsoft store let's fix it guys the first solution is to update windows and check web time date to do this go to search menu and type windows update click on open the windows update settings select check for updates if you have any available update listed over here then you just need to update it guys and make your operating system up to date after doing this on left side select time and language on right side select the date and time you just need to make sure set time zone automatically stand on and set time automatically stand on after turning on both of it, close it off here and check if the problem solved or not. If the problem not solved, let's move on to the second solution guys. The second solution is to restart Windows Update Service, Microsoft Store Install Service and Background Intelligent Service. To do this, you just need to go to search menu and type Services. Click on Open it. Search for Windows Update Service. You just need to double click on it and startup type set to automatic and if the service status is stopped then you just need to start it select apply and ok for save changes now right click on the windows update service and select restart after doing this you need to search for microsoft store install service you just need to double click on it and startup type set to automatic if the service status is stopped then you just need to start it Select Apply and OK for save changes. Right click on the Microsoft Install Service and select Restart. Now you need to search for Background Intelligent Transfer Service. Double click on it. Startup type set to Automatic and if the service status is stopped then you just need to start it. Select Apply and OK. Right click on it and select Restart. now you can check if the problem solved or not if the problem not solved let's move on to the third solution guys the third solution is to repair and reset the microsoft store to do this go to search menu and type store right click on the microsoft store and select app settings you just need to scroll down and select the repair option and select the reset option After getting done, you can check if the problem solved or not. I hope one of these solutions fixed your problem guys. If the video helped you, don't forget to leave a like guys. You can also subscribe me and support me guys. Thank you.